make uh, good projects and by the end of third year at least make some good projects because companies start to come by third year your resume needs to be prepared because uh, that's important in interviews and i have got an offer from tcs through the tcs code vida contest Hi and welcome back to Coding Ninjas, guys. I'm Kabir Singh, and I'm here with another spectacular interview experience for you guys. So today we have a very nice company out there on the list, which is TCS. And today we are going to talk to Alankita, and we're going to understand how many rounds she had for the interview. Also, we'll be trying to understand whatever happened in each round with her, and how many questions were asked, what was the difficulty, and how did you how did she prepare for the same. So let's welcome Alankita and see how it goes. Hi, Alankita, how are you doing? Hello, I'm doing good. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Alankita, can you give me a small introduction about yourself so that we can hop into the interview experience after that? Okay. Hello, everyone. My name is Alankita Singh. I'm a computer science engineer undergraduate from Kite Group of Institutions, and I have got an offer from TCS through the TCS Code Vida contest. That's great. That's really nice. So, Alankita, how many rounds did you have for TCS? Before the interview, I had two coding rounds. Mm-hmm. like the in that uh, first round was of 6 hours okay and uh, it was a 24 hours window was given to attempt that and between that you have to choose the 6 hours which you are comfortable with to give that and mm-hmm. after that i had two interviews okay. first one was for a technical and managerial interview and the second one was the hr interview that's great so can you tell me what actually happened in the 6 hour coding round like how many questions were you asked or what actually happened in those 6 hours because okay. considering 6 hours is a very long span of time so what actually happened in that yeah so in the 6 hours there were 6 to 9 questions that i, I have to attempt and mm-hmm. there were easy questions and the difficulty increases gradually okay so if you go do one or two questions correct like minimum you need to do two to three questions correct then you will get the interview call okay. so i did two to three questions and uh, the thing was that uh, in that the plagiarism is very high because it's a 6 hour window so you can easily get the code from internet or some other sources right so, yeah, so the tcs uh, keeps a very high plagiarism check so you can't just change the variables and uh, copy the same code correct you can, uh, identify that easily Okay, that's pretty decent out there because I guess yeah, six hours is a long span of time and people can you know easily yeah. get their codes up. But uh, moving on to the interview, what actually happened in the first round where you had the technical and the managerial round? The first round was of uh, thirty minutes, and mm-hmm. in that there were three interviewers. So all of them gave their introduction and then they asked about mine. So okay. after the introduction, they asked me about the projects that I have done. Mm-hmm. So I told them about the projects. And after that, there were many questions related to projects. They asked like mine was in web development. So they asked me about Ajax, JavaScript, HTML, CSS, and okay. other why I have used MongoDB, like such questions. And then after that, the in the managerial interview, they asked me a puzzle. And some questions like I was okay with the relocation or that uh, flexible with the timings like that. And uh, just like this, the questions were there. But there was no coding question asked to you in that round. They asked me the logic of quick sort. They didn't ask me to code it, but just the logic or when I'll use that, that was it was. Okay, that's all. Just just one quick sort question. Other than that, everything related to your resume. They were more focused on the project. Okay. To be specific, they were more focused on the projects that I have done. Okay, okay. That's that's really nice. And if I talk to you about this 30-minute round, how much difficulty would you rate it to be? You know, was it easy? Was it medium? Was it hard? It was medium difficulty. Uh, I wouldn't say it was hard. Mm-hmm. Like the questions, they were very basic. Like they were asking the uh, HTML and CSS difference or the types of CSS that I have used. Like okay. some questions were there of React or and Angular also, but they were less. And they were asking the basic knowledge of every subject that I have, like some operating system questions were there, some DBMS questions were also there, like uh, SQL and the MongoDB difference or why I have used MongoDB like that. Okay, okay. So basically, if somebody has a good hold on their projects, they've made it on their own and they have full knowledge about it, for them, it will be somewhere around easy and medium. Yeah. Okay, that's great. And what happened in the HR round after that? So after one or two days, I got the mail about the HR interview that was scheduled. It was around 20 minutes, I guess. And in that, she introduced herself there also. And then she asked me about my introduction. 
and after that she asked questions like where is my hometown how is my family like that she made me comfortable in made me comfortable in the environment okay. then she asked me what i know about the tcs then okay. after that she asked like am i comfortable with the relocation and uh, she asked me about any uh, queries that i i have that i want to ask her then mm-hmm. after that she explained all the policies of the tcs and other things it was a quick 20 minutes or 15 minutes of the interview okay and how much would you rate the difficulty to be like it was easy not any difficult questions was asked. it was just a kind of discussion between two people and about the company like that only okay not not much of that okay that's that's easy yeah. that's easy okay moving forward one last question which i would like to put up on you before we end this interview experience is that what would you recommend your juniors or the people watching this video so that you know some some piece of advice or some tips or tricks which you would like to give them so that they can have a good hold on interviews get a good placement how would you advice that so some tips that i want to give is that first coding is very important and be consistent with coding solve <clears> at <throat> least one to two problems daily second make a uh, good projects and by the end of third year at least make some good projects because companies start to come by third year your resume needs to be prepared because uh, that's important in interviews so right these are the two tips that i want to give that's that's really nice also guys i would like to inform you that alankita has basically written an article for the tcs interview experience on our website so i'll put the link in the description below you can have a look at the article you can read it out you can also solve the problems that she got in the coding test and all of these things and she's detailed out the entire interview experience round wise in her article so if you want to read it out always go to the link in the description below have a look at it and uh, maybe you'll find it handy for your interview experience So thank you so much for watching guys I'll see you in the next one I hope you liked the video so if you did hit the like button and subscribe to Coding Ninjas I'm going to see you in the next one thank you so much for watching happy coding guys